past year of my life will always be remembered, from when I stepped on the stage for the first time last November to now when I walk off it. I realized that none of my DECA experience could have been this great without the help of a few people. I would first like to thank Mr. Price and Mr. Fink for all their help and guidance. A special thanks goes to my mother and DECA advisor, Nadine Scott. I thank you for always being there for me and supporting me in everything I do. Lastly, I would like to say thank you to my fellow officers. You guys have become some of my closest friends and I am thankful for the time we spent together. Your Ohio DECA Secretary Treasurer, Jake Scott. Ohio DECA, it has been one heck of a ride. I would like to give my first thank you to Mr. Nadler and Defiance DECA for giving me the chance to become a state officer. A personal thank you to Mr. Fink and Mr. Price for everything that you have done for me over the past year and making DECA an experience I will never forget. Last but not least, my fellow officers. The memories and the friendships that I have made over the past year will be with me for the rest of my life. Even though we are saying goodbye today, I am sure our paths will meet again in the future. Your Ohio DECA Public Relations Representative, Drew Small. Hello, Ohio DECA. It has been a pleasure serving you over the course of the past year. These were the defining moments of my senior year, and I thank you all for making it possible. In addition, I would like to thank my fellow officers, Mr. Fink and Jim Price, for making this year so much fun. I will never forget the crazy times we shared at our meetings, at states, and of course at nationals. And for all of you entering the new year of DECA, why say the sky's the limit when there are footprints on the moon? Your Ohio DECA Southeast Region Vice President, Sarah Goff. There is no easy way to describe my experience as a state officer. It was nothing I ever expected and more than I could have asked for. It was life changing and helped to put me where I am today. First, I want to thank my team. There was never a dull moment with you guys. I would also like to thank Mitchell Fink, Jim Price, and everyone involved in making Ohio DECA what it is. Thanks to Becky Bird, Mr. Cheney, and Penn for always believing in me. Finally, thank you to my family. I love you and wouldn't know what to do without your support. Your Ohio DECA Northwest Region Vice President, Amanda Frick. Now love is gone and you're in the someone far away. I never thought the day Becoming a state officer was easily the greatest experience I've ever had. There's no way I could have gotten here on my own, and I would like to thank my advisor, Mrs. Lisi, for all of her competition advice, my family for their support, Mr. Fink for keeping us in line and always looking good. Mr. Price for making Ohio Deck the greatest learning experience ever. And last, but definitely not least, to my fellow officers, it was a blast working with you, and I can't thank you enough for making this experience even better. Your Ohio DECA Parliamentarian, Chandler Swanson. Hey Ohio DECA, it's been one heck of a ride. 
The experiences and relationships I have developed through DECA have made this past year really great. I can truly say that DECA has made me into the person I am today, and I am extremely grateful for that. I want to say thank you to my advisor, Kit Lynch, for pushing me to do my best. I also want to give a special thanks to Mr. Fink and Mr. Price for making my experience as a state officer a lasting memory. And I will never forget all of you, Ohio Decca, because you are what makes this organization so great. Finally, I would like to thank my fellow state officers. You guys are truly my best friends. Your Ohio DECA Central Region Vice President, Kyle Beverly. When I, first met you, I, love I cannot believe it's been a year already. Team 67, you are amazing individuals that I will never forget. Thank you for being the nine best friends anyone could ever ask for. Brent Piper, thank you for supporting me and being an exceptional advisor over the last few years. I would also like to thank everyone involved with DECA Camp. It's amazing how one weekend can change so many lives. And lastly, you Ohio DECA. Each and every one of you make all of this possible. Just remember, success is a journey, not a destination. Your Ohio DECA Northeast Region Vice President, Kayla Heritage. When I started junior year, I had not a clue as to what I was getting involved in. I would never have realized how connected I would be to an organization. Many times I have been humbled by the kindness of your hearts, whether it has been by my motivating teacher Robin Holweger, the amazing friends and classmates I've made in DECA, the tremendous care that Mr. Fink, Mr. Price, and Mr. Mangini put into Ohio DECA, my fellow state officers for being the most inspiring friends, or all of you for helping me get here. I'm so thankful. You can never say never Why wow, we don't know it But time and time again Young Your Ohio DECA Southwest we Region Vice President, Madeline Lerner Don't let me go Don't let me go Ohio DECA, I cannot thank you enough for all of the memorable experiences that I have been through during my presidency. I would like to thank Ms. Frobos and Lima Senior DECA for all the support you have given me and for helping me along the way. I would also like to thank you, Ohio DECA, for giving me an experience that I will never forget. Lastly, I would like to thank you, fellow officers, Mr. Price, Mr. Mangini and Mr. Fink for all the great memories, friendships, and experiences that I have been involved with through DECA this past year. It has truly been an experience that I will cherish for the rest of my life. Your Ohio DECA President, Michael Fisher. Ladies and gentlemen, please show your appreciation to the 2010-2011 Ohio DECA State Officer Team. Again and again, we're 